Magnus in Sweden writes to me and he says, Hey Paul, when I am starting to look at a new phono stage, I realize that many phono stages do not use step-up transformers for moving coil, but instead use other technologies. So here is my question. Are step-up transformers the best way to go with moving coil gain or not? If I buy a phono stage and I don't use a step-up transformer for moving coil, but have the moving coil option, would I be better off using my expensive Lundahl, which is a uh, step-up transformer, for moving coil gain, and then use the moving magnet input? Well, Magnus, you're going to have to make that decision on your own through listening, because I don't know the quality of the step-up circuitry inside of your preamp. Generally speaking, a well-designed phono preamplifier, if you bought one from us, you'd be much better off using the built-in moving coil amplification stage in one of our preamps than your transformer by far, okay? But that doesn't apply to everything. There are plenty of phono preamps out there that don't have very good moving coil phono stages, and there your Lundahl transformer is going to be better. So you're going to have to do this. <sighs> hate to say it, but you're going to have to trust your ears. But that's okay, because that's what it's all about anyway, right? At the end of the day, you're looking for the best sound you can get, and you got to use your ears in order to do that. So that's my, that's my advice. Uh, years ago, oh gosh, 40 years ago, when I was designing moving coil, we used to call them head amps, and they are hard because think of what you're trying to do. A moving coil cartridge, a phono cartridge, has about 30 dB lower output than a moving magnet cartridge. So what you need to do is amplify by about 30 dB or 30 times whatever's coming out of that tiny moving coil cartridge and multiply it times 30 and try and do it without any noise. I struggled probably a year trying to figure it out before I finally came up with our moving coil, our MCA we called it, the moving coil amplifier. Clever name. <laughs> it was really hard. And today it's, you know, we know a lot more about it. We use lots of parallel transistors. Every time you parallel a transistor, if you do it correctly, the noise goes down, 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 down. And you can get super low noise, like our stellar phono stage or the upcoming uh, perfect wave phono stage. All those have exceptional sound and exceptionally low noise on the phono, uh, on a moving coil stage. But you're, in your particular instance, you're going to have to use your ears because I don't know what kind of phono stage you're getting. So hope that helps. Good luck, Magnus. All right.